millions of people across Israel and the occupied Palestinian territory were forced to seek shelter. This deadly cycle of tit-for-tat violence must stop. Time is running out. This deadly cycle of tit-for-tat violence must stop. Time is running out. Madam President, Excellencies, the raging fires in the Middle East are fast becoming an inferno. Exactly one week ago, I briefed the Security Council about the alarming situation in Lebanon. Since then, things have gone from bad to much much worse. Allah and other non-state armed groups in Lebanon and the Israel Defense Force, millions of people across Israel and the occupied Palestinian territory were forced to seek shelter. One person was killed from the Iranian strikes, a Palestinian in the occupied West Bank. As I did in relation to the Iranian attack in April, and as should have been obvious yesterday, in the context of the condemnation I expressed, I again strongly condemn yesterday's massive missile attack by Iran on Israel. And these attacks, paradoxically, do nothing to support the cause of the Palestinian people or reduce their suffering. Continues to deteriorate with Israeli military operations, we must never lose sight of the tremendous toll this is growing, that this growing conflict is taking on civilians. And we cannot look away from systematic violations of international humanitarian law. This deadly cycle of tit-for-tat violence must stop. Time is running out, and I thank you.